Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Bert Stallin here, and I'm going to show you guys a tutorial on how to install the Technic, Techit, uh, Yogs Box, and a couple other mods that are included in the Technic mod pack. So let's get started off. To start off, just Google Technic. Can't type. And go to the first link, and you'll go to the Technic website. And that's it, the website. If you can't find it on Google, you should be able to, but who knows what problem you might have. Uh, after that, you can just go to download the Technic Launcher. If you don't see it on the home page, then you could just go to the Technic and download the Technic Launcher. So choose what you need. So I'm going to choose Windows because I'm running Windows. If you're on Mac, I'll try and make a tutorial for all you Mac users to show you guys how to install it on Mac. After that, uh, I dragged mine onto my desktop just to be able to have it on there for quicker use. This is an old version. So I'll delete that. You're gonna want to. I like to run it as administrator just to give it all properties, and so we'll have it a problem. As you see, it would just say downloading percent of launcher, but nothing happened. What you're gonna want to do next is go to percent app data percent. When you're at percent app data percent, you want to do two things. First, you want to delete your dot Minecraft folder because you need a clean, brand new one with nothing on it. If you have a save that you need open it up, drag it out, put it on your desktop, or put it somewhere safe that you know you'll have it. Or have you have a, scene, a screenshot or something that you know you need from in there. So here's my stuff, and there's nothing else I need, so I'm going to delete that folder. Once you're done with that, minimize this. Don't close it because we're still, still going to need it. After that, open up Minecraft. If you have normal Minecraft, you're just going to log in. Type the password in wrong. If you have a cracked Minecraft, you're gonna need to go to op options and click Force Update. Here, it's updating your Minecraft and giving you a brand new clean one. Without this, you won't be able to download the Technic Launcher. So, once you see that it's brand new, you can exit out and go back into your Percent App Data. Uh, folder. You'll see your Dune dot Minecraft in there, and you're gonna want to open your dot Technic launcher. So what I like to do is make a shortcut for it. So after I made a shortcut, I have a folder in here with an old shortcut for it. I have a folder in here that I'm gonna put this new shortcut that I just made for. It. So dragged in there, and I'm gonna open the Technic launcher through this. So as you can see, it says no mod pack selected. What you want to do is you're going to click this arrow and you'll see all the mods right here. You can choose whichever one you want. So if you're installing the Yogg Box, click the Yogg Box. If you're installing this, I, any of these. Vanilla, I think it's just vanilla Minecraft, just straight plain Minecraft. So I'm not sure if you need the launcher for that, but it's just in case you want to use it that way. Uh, we're going to be installing the Tech It, Technic. Uh, if you're installing the Tech It, you would just do the same thing, just click Tech, tech It. So, since we're installing the Technic pack, we're going to go over here, click Technic, and then we're going to put in our username and password. It is safe, guys. Don't worry. I've done it plenty of times, and nothing has happened. Uh, I click Remember because I want it to remember me, so I'll have to click Login in each time. And after that, go to Options. Make sure always use Recommended Build is checked because the development builds sometimes are unstable and might not work completely. Uh, also, retry after connection timeout. Make sure that's checked so you can keep trying and keep trying and keep trying. Uh, memory to allocate. Um, I'm going to give mine just one gigabyte, which is the default. You can give it a little bit less or a little bit more, depending on what you want. You can also clear the cache. Uh, we don't need to do that because ours is brand new. So once you do that, you're going to click login. And you're going to see it's going to start downloading stuff. Mine keeps getting stuck. For some reason, um, you guys might have this problem too, but mine gets stuck on certain places. So what I do is I just log out and open the launcher back up. And it's already on Technic, so I just click login again. Get stuck on 10%. Open back up and log in again. And basically it's pretty uh, redundant, but it's the best method to use. And see, eventually it'll just get past it and just go straight through. So, once that happens, just exit, open back up. 
and this is the best method I've found to get past this problem. Unfortunately, I don't know any other method, and it is pretty redundant, and it does get kind of annoying after a while. So, uh, you guys are probably gonna, you guys might just go straight through. I think the problem is because I am on Minecraft 1.3.1, and right now this is still only for 1.2.5, but it does work for 1.3.1. So, I'm gonna try and install this, and I will cut out the part that I'm installing this because it does take a good bit of time. Okay guys, so my tech at launcher, Technic Launcher just finished and I did have to reset it a good bit of times for it to finish working. After a while, once it gets past the first two uh, loadings, it should go a lot faster after that because after that it's just downloading mods. I'm not sure what the first two are. Um, mine kept getting stuck at the Matmos and Mo Creatures Launcher uh, downloads, but I just kept exiting out. Also, one thing that it did let me do well, that was pretty helpful was if you just click log in because it won't be uh, hidden anymore, it won't be grayed out and after you get to a certain part you can just keep clicking log in, keep clicking log in and then it'll ask you to update the launcher you click yes and that speeds up the process a good bit because it does um, while one thing is frozen it's downloading again it's pretty buggy because it looks like it's flashing when it's downloading um, but again, if it gets stuck after you click log in again, exit out, go back in, and it should start working better and better each time. So, after, as you can see, now that uh, I've downloaded it, it says Minecraft 1.2.5, and that's because the launcher is not yet compatible with Minecraft 1.3.1. But you can see all the mods it has installed here. It doesn't tell you what all of them do, it only tells you what a couple of them do. And. It tells you a couple of these mods that what they it just shows some of the mods that actually affect the menu also um, after that you can go into single player or I'm not even sure if you can go into multiplayer with the mods on but go into single player and just make a new world and let's let it do that it will take a little bit of time considering how many mods it has just installed but once you're done with that you should be able to play just fine and you see that all the mods are installed I have magnet saves there's options so well a good idea would be to just play play around with the mods just for a couple hours not really start uh, onto your world if you're gonna plan if you're planning on doing a world Try not to get too uh, serious on it in the beginning because you're not sure what the mods might what the mods do. I'm not sure. You guys might be, but sorry, I'm not sure. So you might just want to kind of play around with it a little bit, see what it does. Um, because I know that there's so many mods that there's just tons of stuff you can do. I mean, look at that. You can get a musket, so <laughs> cannons, fire rods, musket with a bayonet, dynamite. It's pretty cool. There's so much stuff you could do with these mods. I mean, honestly, the possibilities are almost endless. So, uh, the only bug I have seen so far is that there's no sound. Uh, there's no clicking sound when you click stuff. Uh, there's no... The only sound I can hear is the animals at the moment. And the only other sound is... Well, that's it. The only sound is the animals. There's no other sound, which is kind of a downer because I really don't like playing Minecraft with no sounds. I don't know. It just kind of adds to it. But as you guys can see, the mods just make this game so much more, a lot better. It just make it so complex. And I don't know. I think it's I think it makes the game a good bit uh, more interesting. Gives it more more stuff to do. And that's about it, guys. So if you guys had any problems, please let me leave a comment in the description comment in the description yeah you guys can comment on the description <laughs> no i'm just kidding just leave a comment below let me know what happened what's wrong and i'll definitely try and get on that to see if there's some type of problem what the heck was that and see how to fix it so if you guys need anything just let me know you can also message me so that's it for this tutorial uh this is bro stalling guys hope it helped and peace out